Okay, so tonight we're here at uh, the home of Art Cunningham, and this is the Sierra Lines. Now, this is Sierra Lines version 2. From the previous video that was seen, uh, the railroad has moved from Bella Vista, Arkansas, to Celia, Texas, north of Dallas. So, uh, I think we're playing the same game, just a different place. <laughs> uh, quite impressive that knowing the time frame here, you know, I can tell you recognize many of the buildings. Uh, and I have to say certain things here. This has been an operating railroad for a very long time with large groups of people. And the rebuild is, of course, better than the original. Notice the aisle space. Okay. All right, if we're going to play instructional video tonight, you know, we're going to have six people here operating tonight, which kind of looks like, to me, a small group for this one. You're looking at full, this about four foot aisle. We use car cards. And this is all about running trains from a yard to an industri industrial area, switching the industrial area and going back. See, the nice part about this whole railroad is he had all of these buildings on the old land. All the jobs start simultaneously, so I'm not going to wait for everybody, but we're going to be waiting on each other maybe a little bit during the thing because somebody's going to be in your way. There's uh, the whole town is Sacramento. This is East Sacramento over here. And this job is kind of independent of the rest of the layout. Uh, come out of the yard over there, you run through the layout and come over here, do all your switch in, just go back to that yard over there. So there's no interaction between these cars and those cars. So when you, and there's a possibility of a second shift over here. If you get done with the first shift, first shift has 18 cars coming in here. And uh, if you get all that done, you can do a second shift as nine cars coming back at the same time. That's one job. So local switch or the train engine that comes does the switching? The engine that comes does the switching. Yeah. It's a SD9. Uh, or the second one's a RS2. The um, another, well, the big job is in the yard over there. There's two big trains that come to the yard right off the bat. And the yard guys, Bust them up into four places. Some of them go here, some of them go here, some of them go here, some of them go there, four places. And so uh, by the time he gets those classified, the people over here will have done some enough work that they're bringing stuff to the yard. And then they bring more stuff back from the yard. And then at the end of the session, they say, everything ends up in the yard. And everybody's happy. Happy. And nobody made any defects. Everybody did exactly what it says. <laughs> <laughs> so this particular section, this is called downtown over here. And it's uh, an industry where from here down to the wall, there's a 22 car train that switches this. This from here, from right here to the wall is called Old Town. Same thing, it has a 22 car train that switches this. This section from the silo to there, this is the industrial park. This uh, train starts here, picks up 13, makes a couple of local moves, takes them to the yard, brings back 13, sets them out. Uh, this guy is likely to get done before the others, and there's an ore train, a gold ore turn. Under staging, and it goes down to the 
Mother load mine picks up the gold ore, brings it back to the ore cracker. If you get that box. Then the last section, besides the yard, is here. To maneuver your car carts. To the wall. This is called North Sacramento. And there's 20 cars that come to this section out of the yard. And um, both that that section, this section, and this section all have possibility of second shift work if you get done. There's an interchange track here, for example, and there's blue car cards. Everything else is white. So for your normal work, you got white car cards. If you have a like for example, this industry, Kelly Tires, she's got three cars there. These two are for super ship work. Anything with a white card in it, you pick it up and take it to the yard. And then he, the yard guy, will flash by it into where it's going after that. All you care about is it's white, pick it up, take it to the yard. The blue Simple. one is for second ship work. That goes to the interchange track. And so if you get that far, you can do second ship work, earn extra pay. Uh -huh. <laughs> but of course, there is an extra possibility of having a defect, which you wouldn't want. Okay? So it's take your chance. So if you have one like this, this is um, Carney Croissant Company. And so there's one white one and one that's empty. That one stays there. No car card? Don't move it. Just leave it there. So this one's one pickup. And these are all the second shift interchange because they're all blue, right? Uh, all the turnouts that you can see and reach are a Pico. You just throw them by hand like this. These are reused, right? Yes. Everything Almost from all of these yeah. are used turnouts that I ripped out of my other hand. Um, we got picks here. If you're all familiar with digital tracks, we have all the throttles, our radio throttles, so the real simple ones. No, they don't know. Okay. NCE most of them. They all NCE right, well, people. This is what your problem looks like. I've <laughs> already dialed up your engines. I'm digital track. Yeah, you are, but and, I'm just. Uh, some of them have sound. Most of them have sound. If you want to blow the horn, it's F2. Blow the horn. If you want to ring the bell, that's F1. You can turn the light on and off at F0 on some of them. Some of them it's just on all the time. And there's other sounds sometimes. Uh, these are radio throttles. Um, some of you will run a train to the yard and then you'll change to another engine. So all you do is just change the number on here. And it tells you on your instructions what the address is. Most of them are two digit. So you just dial in those two digits, plug it in, there'll be places where you can plug it in. And that, when you plug it in, it acquires the engine and you'll get a green light here. And then you got the new engine. You don't need to dispatch the old engine, you don't have too many. You have to have like 22 before you have to worry about dispatching engines. So just change the number, plug it in, and you got your engine. And there's a radio receiver in that building, and another one in the building over there. So, pretty good coverage everywhere. It might be possible if you're down in the corner there and you're down and you're backing up with your body. Especially some of you guys got heavy metal bodies, you know. <laughs> and block the signal. So, um, what else? So to start, there's a train over here, 22 car train is going to run on the back side and come into the yard. Another train over here, that one's the LSNI train, this one here is the Western Pacific, it's going to run through the layout and come into the yard also. And both those uh, get their engines put over here and then they have other trains ready to leave as soon as they get here. One of them is going to have to use a taxi. They have to taxi over here. <laughs> After they get to the yard, they taxi over here, and then here's your engine and caboose for picking up on this side. This guy over here, he's 
starts here, so that's, I guess hey, he lived in that building over there. <laughs> this would be main line here. Main line is the brown. The brown is the main Yeah, you've got to keep off the main. That's the biggest so you secret. Can, uh, you can cross it and use it to go up and down, but you can't park something on it. Hmm. Otherwise, you get. I don't know, it's probably worse than a defect. Yeah, well, yeah. It's mm. probably worse than having a defect. So I think we put somebody in the closet one time at the old house, locked the door. <laughs> oh, yes. Here's a couple, of, here's a three way over here. Yeah. Here's a double slip. That might be the only three way. But lots of double slip switches. There's a trick right here. A lot of guys think, well, I'll just, I'll just go this way. But no, that's just a diamond. That's uh, not, not a three way. That's a diamond. So you're going to run around, you got to do it here to here. You can run around there. You can run around over there. So it's okay to use the money to cross, but you can't park anything on the map. Right. So. So you, there's not very many trains going by, so you don't have to worry too much about this. going up and down the main. Uh, what else do I need to tell you? Well, this is... Uh, Exactly. So a lot of layouts they have to compromise, you know, between the what they're going to model and the real. But not here. This is exactly the way it would have been in 1954, given the bigger earthquake in California in 1948, which uh, changed everything. It shook up the Sierras. It revitalized the gold and ore mines that had silver mines that had played out. Kept the Virginia and Truckee Railroad alive, and so they're part of the amalgam here. We have the Virginia Truckee, they're the one switching uh, East Sacramento using uh, these engines from the SP and the Sierra Central. We have the Western Pacific, they're here because the Toyabe volcano went off after the earthquake and wiped out the Feather River route. And so they had to come, oh it also wiped out Reno by the way. So the SP main line and the WP main line were both wiped out by the Two eruptions of the Toyabe volcano, and so they all had to come through here. Of course, Dr. Smith is the, the uh, owner of the Sierra Lines, who started the Lodestone Sierra and Incline Village Railroad, and put all these others together, including the Sierra Central. It's because of the 49er Gold Rush, 1949. Came about as a result of the 1948 earthquake. And so then they've been rebuilding and amalgamating and doing things. And so now here it is. This is the way it really was, would have been April Works 1st, for me. 1954. So some of you might notice some 55 Chevys sitting around here and there. Well, that's because they came out early that year. <laughs> <laughs> and it's because. You could buy them at Walmart for a buck and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good cars for a buck and a half, wouldn't you say? <laughs> so let me ask you, are you going to show us your modeler's license? <laughs> <laughs> so if you uh, want to know more details, we have a 10-page history of that. How this, uh, history. Tell us how the Sierra Lines came to be. Okay. So I'm sure you all want to move back tonight. <laughs> so now you get to pick up. So over here on the board, we have the instructions for the six jobs. Everyone has there's a corporate culture that goes with each of the five railroads. And one of the yard jobs is run by the LSI and management. So we have the Virginia Turkey. So you want to, if you, whatever job you get, well, read what that. this one on the end here? So you know how to be, that's the industrial park. That's industrial park. So you're so central. central. So this is, is this Sacramento? This is East Sacramento. So East Sacramento, downtown, Old Town, industrial park, North Sacramento, and the Yard and Box. This is the one right here, this yeah. guy here. What's that like? 
I'm fairly new to everything, so I'll probably have any questions for you. Oh, yeah, no, no problem. Just the one on the back wall. That's downtown. Downtown. All right. Let me see. I better start right here. Who took East Sacramento? You've got to see it. All right. You're John. And Industrial Park. David, got it? Yes. Uh, uh, okay. So we got three more. Now, by the way, the yard job, uh, when you get a break, which you probably will, there's uh, 12 pickups and set outs over there. So there's some industries along the wall to switch by the yard guy. Is there, what is the direction, like, like as far as travel? Well, west, west where mostly. Like, 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 Here's right here. Whatever y'all want to do. Uh, they're making it. I don't care. You pick, you pick whatever one you want. If you want to be the yard guy, fine. If not, I'll take it. Don't Doesn't matter. I'm, you know. It's got a lot of work in it. You know, you got to set up your east, your, all your four different railroads over there. Mm -hmm. Put me down as for the five. This is my industry here. I think I ran the Ellis and I job one time. Okay. So. Let's uh, take a look here. So the board, you come over and he's got six jobs for each people to do. And if you're going to run a model railroad and have it operate, this is extremely good. This is very simple. Uh, his car card system in, in, is not involved at all, as you saw during the early part of the video. So we have six jobs, and one of them's a yard job, but it's big yards. You got a lot of work to do. So, and he's got instructions on what you do, and they're very simple. Uh, so you're going to do move a lot of cars and a lot of trains, and just follow up work on everything. But to run this whole schedule, I'll guarantee it'll take us all. Of, we're going to be here for three hours. It'll actually probably be closer to four to run this whole thing. So anyway, we're going to sh go on here. You listen to the whole startup thing. Try to take some shots of everybody doing their switching during the evening. Okay. Michael, you're the WP, right? All right, there's your towel. Your train is right there. Your first job is you got to take that train to the yard. And on the way, you have to pull the main in Old Town, which is right here. So when you get here, you got to hold the main until the SP train gets past you. Then you can proceed to the yard. Uh, right you're going to hold the main here. We'll go around you. We'll go around you on this. Yeah. Okay. All right, we're going to start. Yeah. You only use the, 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 the last one. The last two it's already there. Yeah, it's be like 22. Okay. Ready, well. That's good. Well, I want to say that works. So, here's an example here with the wide aisles. Okay? Lots of room because I got to get over here. I'm coming in, right. yeah. Everybody can depart. So, you're ready to go. You're the SP. Okay, so you have to pass uh, the WP in Old Town. Where's my first work area? Here comes the SP. Lee's, Lee's, Lee's got the Algo train master here. And um, it's hot, that's going to be Okay, so the tracks, this part is a track one. Oh, I one, see two, you. three, four, oh, five, okay. six, seven, eight. Okay. Okay. Yes. 
And so these are going to the industry. Yeah, I'm coming up on you. I'm going to hold it right there. I'm going to hold it until the kids are not. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm supposed to be on the side. Yeah, I forgot what we say on the construction. Passing siding in Old Town. This is Old Town. Old Town. Old Town. Yeah. Read the book, so pass the book. Or here, you know what? But the WP guy's on the main. Yeah, I'm on the main. Uh, uh, yeah, I guess the only way you can get there is now from here. So why don't you go over there on that track? That's one pass. Okay, so I'm coming in here. Okay. Uh, you have to get a neutral. Move forward. Oh, okay. Center is off. That's it. Thank you. Okay. Okay. This road's done with the thick paper. Since I have so many. Uh, Grade crossings. I have to figure out how to do it fast. Yeah. <laughs> the grades just painted. Super for 25 cents. 1954. Okay. 25 cents a gallon. There you go. All right. We got to go to work over here. We've run the uh, freight into the yard, and he's going to start working on that. And I. And he's now got two freights. So I have to come over here and I have to work North Sacramento, and that's my engine. We have to work all the industries. And uh, we got a whole bunch of cars set out, put up thing here. So we're in the process here of switching out our cars and working all the little industries. Accumulating cars that have to go to the yard. So we throw the switch, flip the controller back, and we're going to put these three cars here for pickup. These are all going to end up going in our train back to the yard. And, um, uh, so it's, um, Okay, so you need a pick. Okay, so we're going to go up here now. We're after these uh, industries over here. This is the cars here. Um, and they're going to, car cards are down here. So our engine is moving over here. Whoops. So we need to. Now we got them all hooked up. Now we need to determine which cars have to go. And what I'm going to do here. Is I'm gonna look on the building and it says uh, mechanical company and let's see. Okay, let's try this because so we got the two companies, cannery company. This is the interchange. Um, Kelly's tire. Blacksmith. And we're looking for car G N. One eight five one. So that's the right there. Look down in there. That gives me the first number. That's one car. And the cannery. We got two cars. One stays. We got to pick up this one. So we're looking for ATSF. That's that car. Thirteen five five zero six. Thirteen five five zero six. So the first and the last cars are out. So we're going to pull those out. So we're going to, we're going to drop move. 
and you have to reset the cars. So this is the main line here, the brown. So I can't be out there playing on the main. Not that we have a lot of traffic on this railroad, but we just can't do that. I have to leave it open so we can cross back and forth, but uh, that separates, it tells you where it is. So we're gonna break these cars up, get the first and last one to where we can utilize them. Okay. So we've uh, replaced the two cars that are not going. We're gonna come over here and throw our Pico switch. And we're gonna go back here and get the train. Now these cars are on the back end of my engine. And I'm trying to conserve space as I build the train. So this is my caboose and that's one of my cars that's gonna go to the yard. And I have space to put this these two cars right on that train. So we come over here, throw the switch, and back up. Okay. So ah, now the next move. So this is Valley Shippers. Now we got four cars here. It's telling me to pick up two. The first one and the last one. Cannot pull four cars in the engine with the space I got. So you're gonna have to do a lap over. Okay, you know. Have to move one and come back and see how it works to get the other one. We don't make things easy all the time, do we? So we know it's the first car, so we're gonna leave stop right here and we're gonna leave we're gonna put this car out. So we let pull that oh, out really? through the switch. What did the where did you find it? Oh, okay. Cool. I'll be home uh, I'll be home for Sunday night for week. Okay, so we have a little meet here. Sierra Central. We'll pass the SP. And the West Pacific train comes through. Now we can get back out on the main and finish some of the last moves.